Hi, I'm Congressman Dan Kildee, Chief Deputy Whip of the House Democratic Caucus and a proud son of a U.S. Navy veteran. November 11 is Veterans Day, a day to honor all of those who have served our country. As a member of Congress, I'm committed to honoring our nation's heroes by making sure that they are taken care of after serving our country. This Congress, we focused on getting results in fulfilling the promises we've made to our veterans. With 25 hearings and 24 separate bills passed, I'm proud to say that we are starting to achieve just that. But our work doesn't stop here. This is Veterans Day and we must go beyond a simple thank you for your service. We must continue to fulfill the promises we've made to those who serve and put their lives on the line for our country. Whether it's battling the suicide epidemic, boosting veterans benefits, or protecting veterans from toxic chemical exposure, I will continue to fight for veterans and their families and am committed to keeping our promise to care for those who served. Veterans Day honors everyone who has served in the U.S. military. But not all veterans are here with us today. That's why it's important to celebrate and honor every veteran for their service in the military. I remember my father, Jack, on this day, and I try very hard to embody the core values of service, selflessness, and friendship that my dad learned from his time in the Navy and that he felt were so important to pass on to me. I'm proud to represent all veterans across Michigan's 5th Congressional District, and I encourage you to take this opportunity to not just thank a veteran for their service, but to ask them about it. It's important to bridge that gap between veterans and civilians because such a small portion of the population serves or has close connections to the military. And there's no better way to honor veterans than to provide them the opportunity to tell you their story. Thank you.